servant of God is a term used for individuals by various religions for people believed to be pious in the faith's tradition. In the Catholic Church, it designates an individual who is being investigated by the Church for possible canonization as a saint. In the Eastern Orthodox Church, this term is used to refer to any Eastern Orthodox Christian. The Arabic name Abdullah from Bidi al, Abd Allah, slave of God. The Hebrew name Obadiah, Wabdai, the German name Gotchik, and the Sanskrit name Devadaza are all variations of servant of God. Topic: <laughs> Christianity. Topic: Topic: Bible. Topic: The expression servant of God appears eight times in the Bible, the first four in the Old Testament, the last four in the New. The Hebrew Bible refers to, "...Moses the servant of Elohim", Ebed Helahim Ebed HaElohim, 1 Chronicles 6 verses 49, 2 Chronicles 24–9, Nehemiah 10 verse 29, and Daniel 9 verse 11. Judges 2 verse 8 refers to Joshua as Ebed Yahweh, the New Testament also describes Moses in this way in Revelation chapter 15 verse 3, tu dulu tu theo tio u dulu tio u theo. Paul calls himself, a servant of God, in Titus chapter 1 verse 1, dulos theo dulos theo, while James calls himself, a servant of God and the Lord Jesus Christ. Theo kai kiryu isau Christau doulos Theo kai kiryu isau Christau doulos in James chapter 1 verse 1, 2 Peter chapter 2 verse 16 describes servants of God. Theo douloi Theo douloi being free to act within the bounds of God's will. Following grammatical conventions established in the King James Bible, the word servant is never capitalized or used as a title of nobility. The servant is not greater than his lord. Catholic Church Servant of God is an expression used for a member of the Catholic Church whose life and works are being investigated in consideration for official recognition by the Pope and the Catholic Church as a saint in heaven. The term, "'Servant of God' Latin, Servus Dei should not be confused with Servus Servorum Dei Servant of the Servants of God, one of the titles of the Pope. The term servant of God is used in the first of the four steps in the canonization process. The next step is being declared venerable, upon a decree of heroism or martyrdom by the honored. That is followed by beatification, with the title of blessed. After the confirmation of miracles resulting from the intercession of the honored, the final step is canonization, where the honored would receive the title of saint. The process for canonization is under the jurisdiction of the Congregation for the Causes of Saints. An incomplete list can be found in the list of servants of God and candidates for sainthood. Servant of God is not considered a canonical title in a strict sense by the Catholic Church as for instance venerable or blessed are, but only a technical term used in the process of beatification. Hence, any of the faithful can be named a «servant of God» in a larger frame of meaning. <laughs> Hinduism. Topic. A guru or sat guru in various traditions of Hinduism is given the name Dasa, or servant of God. A teacher also can be called Uda ka Das, which means the servant of God. In Sanskrit, the word Dasa, iast dasa means servant, and this meaning is retained in all Indian languages where devotion to a personal god is practiced. In Tamil, Tantai, Dasa, servant, or slave commonly are used to refer to devotees of Vishnu or Krishna. According to Gaudiya Vaishnava theology, as expressed in the Smriti statement Dasa Bhutto Harar Eva Nanyasveva Katakana, living entities are eternally in the service of the Supreme Lord Hari. Thus, designation for Vaishnavas was the status title Dasa as part of their names, such as Hari Dasa, Narayana Dasa, Ram Das, Gopal Das, etc. See also Topic List of servants of God American Catholic servants of God, venerables, beati, and saints Topic 
References External links Media related to Servants of God at Wikimedia Commons <laughs>